I'm Sean Castle Singer. do graffiti art and uh, illustrate. I got like a little book, it looked like a script. They asked me to uh, just come up with uh, different mediums, whatever I wanted to do. I ended up spray painting walls, uh, doing stuff on the computer, doing loose illustrations with pencil, watercolor, different, all types of mediums. Do you have like a favorite illustration in here? Is oh jeez. I like this one. Um, I like the lighting, I guess, in it. It just has good color composition. I tried to stick with a color scheme and a kind of a theme for the whole book. And I used a lot of these like glowy teal and purple and blue colors. And I did some that were basically geared for darker pages. And then I did some of these lighter illustrations so we could have varying pages. So some of them would be light pages and some of them would be dark pages. I don't imagine this was legal even, I don't think. <laughs> well, none of them. Were any of these legal? Yeah. You get, oh, you got permission for them. Well, we, we, we have our areas that we paint all the time that, uh, you know, people let us paint. I've always grown up in that culture, I guess, started with skateboarding when I was like seven. I was doing graffiti when I was a little kid, even though I didn't really know what I was doing. And then I would uh, take that hair color, spray hair color, you know, from like the CVS or whatever uh, stores, and they would and I would just like draw on the walls of my school, behind the school and stuff like that when I was in like fourth grade. And, you know, it was just me and my friends messing around. Later on in high school, beginning of high school, I started uh, looking at uh, graffiti magazines and uh, subway art books and all that stuff. And I started getting into it and started painting. Took my door off my closet and started painting that outside. I was into all types of different stuff. Like, it was a little bit different. And that's why I think I fell into CBS because you know, we're all kind of like punk rockers, skateboarders, metalheads. It's kind of a different side of graffiti that people don't think of and when they think of LA graffiti, but it's actually a big part of it. It's kind of a Hollywood area crew and it's a, it's kind of a tradition that, you know, we're a little bit different than a lot of the other crews, you know. We're not gangbanging. There are people that are musicians that are rappers in the crew and there's also people that are musicians that are, uh, in metal bands and punk bands. It's just kind of a versatile, different kind of crew, and I'm glad to be a part of it. Actually, I was at a club a long time ago, and I uh, I guess I danced with her. She found me on the internet somehow, I guess back when MySpace was still around. I didn't have any pictures of myself or anything, I just have my artwork on there. I ended up going and meeting up with her and then we're like, oh yeah, I remember you. I think we just went out and got coffee or something and she showed me the whole book and I ended up uh, going for it and doing the illustrations. part of this book and it was cool I got to have some of my friends get tags and be involved in it I'm glad it's out and available here it is